Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, His sufferings are remembered. Our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. He gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, you gave, gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. <clears throat> The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth and beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ, our Lord, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the sorrowful mysteries. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Fifth Sorrowful Mystery The Crucifixion and Death of Jesus Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God. God. Despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, whoever glorious and blessed Virgin, Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten, begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant to beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment 
let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we praise you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love is striped incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching. In speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today, we celebrate the feast day of Saint Matthew, Apostle and Evangelist. Saint Matthew was a publican, that is, a tax collector for Rome, a profession that was despised by the Jews. Our Lord called him to be an apostle. His vocation reveals all profession, all works, and all other endeavors should be sanctified. According to tradition, he preached the gospel as far as Persia or Ethiopia. He is the author of the first gospel, and his name appears in the Roman canon in the Eucharistic Prayer 1. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church, integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and, and my, my mouth, mouth shall declare, declare your praise. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with grace and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. The Lord is God, the mighty God the great king over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, then let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness, when at Meribah and Massa they challenged me and provoked me, although they have seen all of my works. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Please be seated.
<clears throat> My commandment is this, love one another as I have loved you. O oh God, you are my God, for you I long, for you my soul is thirsting, my body pines for you, like a dry weary land without water, so I gaze on you in the sanctuary, to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life, my lips will speak your praise, so I'll bless you all my life, in your name I will lift up my hands, my soul shall be filled as with a banquet, my mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of my wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. There is no greater love than to lay down your life for your friends. Bless the Lord, all your works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. You are my friends, says the Lord, if you do what I command you. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion's sons exalt in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples. To bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron to carry out the sentence reordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Glory, 
We're pleased to choose as an apostle Saint Matthew, the tax collector. Grant that sustained by his example and intercession, we may merit to hold firm in following you. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, I, a prisoner for the Lord, urge you to live in a manner worthy of the call you have received, with all humility and gentleness, with patience, bearing with one another through love, striving to preserve the unity of the Spirit through the bond of peace. One body and one spirit as you were also called to the one hope of your call. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and Father of all, who is over all and through all and in all. But grace was given to each of us according to the measure of Christ's gift. And he gave some as apostles, others as prophets, others as evangelists, others as pastors and teachers to equip the holy ones for the work of ministry for building up the body of christ until we all attain to the unity of faith knowledge of the son of god to mature manhood to the extent of the full stature of christ the word of the lord thanks be to god their message goes out through all the earth. Their message goes out through all the earth. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament proclaims His handiwork. Day pours out word to day, and night to night imparts knowledge. Their message goes out through all the earth. Not a word nor a discourse, whose voice is not heard. Through all the earth their voice resounds, and to the ends of the world, their message their message goes out through all the earth please send Hallelujah. 
praise you, O God. We acclaim you as Lord. The glorious company of apostles praise you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. As Jesus passed by, he saw a man named Matthew sitting at the customs post. And Jesus said to him, Follow me. And Matthew got up and followed him. While he was at table in his house, many tax collectors and sinners came and sat with Jesus and his disciples. The Pharisees saw this and said to his disciples, Why does your teacher eat with the tax collectors and sinners? Jesus heard this and said, Those who are well do not need a physician, but the sick do. Go and learn the meaning of the words. I desire mercy not sacrifice. I did not come to call the righteous, but sinners. My dear friends, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Mga two days ago po, mga kapatid, bigla pong naantig ang puso ko sa isang video na aking nakita. Nakita lamang po sa isang timeline. Nabuksan ko sapagkat yung titulo po ng video ay ganito. Anak, huwag mong saktan yan. Tao din yan. Sabi ko, o ba, kakaiba to this time? Paano ba naman kasi? Eh, madalas na nakikita natin sa timeline ng, ng FBI. Lahat na lang medyo may, may joke yung dating. Alam ko, alam niyo yung, yung style ng mga Frank. May tipong, may halong kasi nung alingan. Although joke yung intention, pero hindi totoo. Kaya nga naman itong video in na ito na nakita ko, mga two days ago lang, yung title eh, Sinani lang ang malakas, nakwabong saktan yan, tao din yan. Yung bungad po ng video ay ganito, yung anak ay bit-bit yung isang binatilyo. Dito, dito yung hawak niyo. Bit-bit-bit niya. Papunta sa bahay, sumisigaw yung anak, Nay! Tay! Andito na! Ang pagkakaunawa ko po sa video ay yung batang iyon ay nagnakaw. Nagnakaw, hinabol ng anak, nahuli niya yung binatilyo. Nagnakaw. Nung nahuli niya, sinaktan niya, tapos talang dito, bitbit niya yung, yung bata. Hindi naman bata talaga, binatilyo. Sumisigaw sa Tay! Labas na kayo! Nandito na yung batang to! Andito na! Yung taong ito! Tapos medyo masama po yung mga sinasabi. Kumbaga, nasasaktan yung bata. Maya-maya, lumabas yung nanay. Sabi niyo, nak, 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 maawa ka. Huwag mong saktan to. Tao din to. Tapos sabi ng ano, hindi, hindi, talagang, alam mo yung galit na galit. Sino ba naman kasi? Medyo, sabi ko nga po, ang pagkaunawa ko sa video, parang may ginawang pagnanakaw, may kinuha. Kaya sabi ng ano, dalhin yan sa barangay, dalhin yan. Habang bitbit at hinihila-hila nung, nung, nung anak, kita mo yung sinisigaw ng nanay, nak, nak, huwag mong saktan yan. Tao din yan. Mga kapatid, sa Ebanghelyo makikita natin yung, yung pinapakita sa eksena ng video na nakita ko. Yung konsepto ng pagmamahal ng Diyos. Sa pagmam ang pagmamahal ng Diyos, malawak. Ang pagmamahal ng Diyos ay para sa lahat, maging sino ka man. The love of God exempts nobody. Kung ano man ang naging nagawa mo. Kaya kitang-kita mo sa eksena, 
walang pinipili ang pag-ibig ng Diyos. Ang pag-ibig ng Diyos ay para sa lahat, sa mga taong mabubuti at ganun din sa mga taong naging mahina, nagkasala. Sabi nga po, paano ba naman kasi ganyan mismo ang Diyos? Pagkat ang Diyos mismo ay pag-ibig, hindi niya kayang saktan ang ni isa sa atin sapagkat iyan ang nature ng Diyos, ang pag-ibig para sa lahat. Kaya ito yung unang hamon sa atin mga kapatid, nitong kapistahan ni San Mateo. Tayo mga Kristiyano, sumusunod sa mga turo at utos ng ating Panginoon. Paano nga ba yung konsepto ng ating pag-ibig? Pag-ibig ba na makatao o pag-ibig na makajos? Ito yung unang hamon na nais natin marahil ay tignan natin sa ating pananampalataya. Paano ba? Anong konsepto bang pag-ibig ang nabuo sa akin bilang isang anak ng Diyos? Bilang isang kristyano at nananampalataya at nagsisimbat na nanalangin, ano ba yung pag-ibig na nabuo ngayon? Ito ba'y pag-ibig na na exclusive? Ito ba'y pag-ibig na namimili? Ito ba yung pag-ibig na mas nangingibabaw yung self-interest? Ito ba yung pag-ibig na naghahanap lamang ng kasikatan? Ito ba yung pag-ibig na sarado sa kapwa? Ito ba yung pag-ibig na ako lang? O pag-ibig na may Diyos? Pag-ibig na makadiyos? Katulad sa eksena na akin nakita, na na huwag mong saktan yan. Nagkasalaman, nagkamaliman ang binatilyong iyan. Tao din yan. Yun ang unang hamon sa atin sa Ebanghelyo. Marahil makita mo sa eksena si Mateo, sa Mateo ay isang makasalanan. Hindi ko sinasabi, hindi po sinasabi ng Ebanghelyo, mapalad ang mga makasalanan. Hindi po pinapasabi sa atin na mapalad ang mga magnanakaw. Mapalad ang mga nagsisinungaling, mapalad ang mga nagtitik advantage sa mga mahirap. Hindi po yun ang punto ng ating Ibanghelyo. Ang punto ay pinapakita yung tunay na pag-ibig ng Diyos. At ang pag-ibig ng Diyos ay para sa lahat, maging sino man tayo. Ngayon, paano napasok sa eksena si Mateo? Ay tamang-tama po kapistahan ni San Mateo. Si San Mateo na po siya po yung ibanghilista. The evangelist mismo. At mismo yung ibanghilyong ito, siya ang nagsulat nito. Bakit siya umangat? Yung pagiging makasalanan ba ang dahilan sa kanyang pag-angat? Yung pagiging tax collector ba ang dahilan ng kanyang pag-angat sa ating ibanghilyo? Bakit umangat sa eksena si San Mateo? Mga kapatid, sabi ko nga po, ang pag-ibig ng Diyos ay malawak at ang pag-ibig ng Diyos ay para sa lahat na kahit baka salanin ka man, kahit nakakalimutan man natin, nandoon pa rin ang pag-ibig ng Diyos. At kung meron mang nagpapaangat sa eksena ng ating Ibanghelyo sa persona ni San Mateo, ay yung pagiging yung siya mismo ang nakakita ng pag-ibig na ito sapagkat nakakalungkot nung panahong iyon, hindi po napapansin ng na mga paseyo ang pag-ibig na napakita ng Diyos sa tao. Mismo minsan yung mga tagasunod ni Jesus, hindi nila nakikita yung pag-ibig na iyon. Subalit, nung nakita at nakausap ng Panginoon sa Mateo, nakita niya mismo ang malawak na pag-ibig ng Diyos sa Kanya. Na mismong siya mismo naramdaman niya. Kaya ito yung pangalawang hamon sa atin. Nararamdaman ba natin ang pag-ibig ng Diyos sa atin? Sa panahong ito ng pandemya, na minsan ay nagkakaroon ng pabago-bago, minsan tambay, minsan hindi, minsan close, hindi, minsan may trabaho, minsan wala, minsan sagana, minsan Walang-wala. Sa mga eksena ng ating pang-araw-araw na buhay, mga kapatid, 
tuloy-tuloy ba natin napansin ang malawak na pag-ibig ng Diyos sa atin? Si Mateo nakita ito. At itong nakakat- na- nakakatuwa kay San Mateo nung naramdaman niya ang pag-ibig na iyon sa Diyos. Iniwan niya ang lahat. Si San Mateo ay isang tag- itagakulekta ng buwis. Sabi ko nga po, marahil ang ginagawa ni San Mateo, tagabilang ng pera lamang. Puro material ang kanyang nasa isip. Material lang ang nasa kanyang puso at isipan. Pero nung naramdaman niya ang pag-ibig ng Diyos, iniwan niya ang lahat. He was able to transcend beyond material things. He was able to transcend his own weaknesses. Yung mismo kanyang makasalanan. Kaya mahalaga na dapat alalahanin natin ang pag-ibig ng Diyos. Yung pag-ibig na pinapakita ng Diyos sa atin sapagkat this is the key for us to be able to transcend our own weaknesses, our own sinfulness. Kaya mula noon, kung dati puro material ang nasa utak ni San Mateo, matapos naramdaman ng pag-ibig ng Diyos, kapwa ang naging ibabaw na. Kaya no wonder, kung napapansin niyo po dito, makikita niyo po sa mga simbahan ito, ito po ay nagsisimbolo ng four evangelists at si San Mateo ay nandun. Kung napapansin niyo po, may mga simbolo sila. Si San Marco, Lion. Dito, si San Lucas. Kita niyo? Hayop din, ito. Hayop. Pero nag-iisa lamang si San Mateo na tao. Anghel ang kanyang simbolo. Bakit? Sabi ko nga po, matapos naramdaman ang pag-ibig ng Diyos, iniwan ang lahat, kinalimutan ang lahat ng material, bukod tanging kapwa ang nangibabaw sa Kanya. Kaya mga kapatid, nitong kapistahan ni San Mateo, tatlong bagay ang pinapaalala sa atin. Una, ang pag-ibig ng Diyos. Ang pag-ibig ng Diyos ay para sa lahat. Pangalawa, paano ba? Anong pag-ibig ba ang nabuo sa atin ngayon? Nararamdaman ba natin ito? Pangatlo, mahalaga na alalahanin lagi natin ang pag-ibig na ito sapagat ito ang tulay ng tunay na pagbabago, pagbabago na kung saan mas mangingibabaw ang malasakit sa kapwa, makasalanan na o hindi. Katulad sa eksena na nakita ko sa video, yung anak may malasakit, may malasakit sa nanay niya, sa tatay niya. Pero yung nanay, may malasakit din. May malasakit sa anak niya, sa asawa niya, pero kasama din yung malasakit sa binapilyong nagkasala. We all stand. St. Matthew's life was changed by the call and challenge of the Master. May our prayers express our conversion of life, which makes our sensitive, makes us sensitive to the needs of others. And for every petition, we shall say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the programs of renewal may mark our Catholic life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That we may accept the challenge and call to conversion rather than give in to the invitations of the world. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those involved in financial matters may not sacrifice their souls for wealth and power. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the spiritually infirmed may seek help in the sacrament of healing. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, 
and for all those whom we promise to pray, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For the bishops of the Philippines, and for our brothers and ministry at St. Thomas Aquinas and St. Raymond of Penyafort, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That the dead may be forgiven of their sins, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Almighty God, with the prayers of St. Matthew, accept the petitions of your people, especially those who are around and those who are joining, joining us in this live stream Holy Mass. Bring along all their intentions and petitions and needs and seeking for the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag and for the intercession of St. Matthew. We ask all this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you. Fruit of the earth and work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual dream. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, it my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. As we celebrate anew the memory of Saint Matthew, we bring your sacrifices and prayers, O Lord, humbly imploring you to look kindly on your church, whose faith you have nourished by the preaching of the apostles. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks, Almighty God. For you have built your church to stand firm on apostolic foundations, to be a lasting sign of your holiness on earth, and offer all humanity your heavenly teaching. Therefore, now and for all ages unending, with all the hosts of angels, we sing to you with all our hearts, crying out as we acclaim. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest. Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gifts we pray sending down your spirit upon them like the Jew Paul, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. 
at that time I was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion. He took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith to celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection. We offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church is spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our Pope, Socrates, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, Saint Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, Saint Matthew, and all the saints of pleased to throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him, and with Him, and in Him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say.
Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. And now let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you all. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Please stand. On the foundation stones of the heavenly Jerusalem, the names of the twelve apostles of the Lamb are written. The Lamb of God is the light of that holy city. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, the promise of all, that he would save us from the hands of us, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, who set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight, all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, 
the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine in those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. On the foundation stones of the heavenly Jerusalem, the names of the twelve apostles of the Lamb are written. The Lamb of God is the light of that holy city. Let us pray. Sharing in that saving joy, O Lord, with which St. Matthew welcomed to the Savior as a guest in his home, we pray. Grant that we may always be renewed with the food we receive from Christ, who came to call not the just, but sinners to salvation, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated for an announcement. Brothers and sisters, good morning. The Dominican Community of the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag is pleased to inform you that the October Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag will be on October 3, 2021, first Sunday of October. The Novena Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon, and 4.30 p.m from September 24 to October 2, 2021, an additional Mass at 3 p.m. on September 26, Sunday. We invite you to participate in these Novena Masses and be one with us in expressing our devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. If you wish to sponsor one or several of the Novena Masses, you may fill out the form at the Councils for Masses area and submit it with your donation, and you will be given an acknowledgement receipt. Or, you may visit our website at www.manawagminorbasilica.org at Online Pamisa, where you will find available online and other options for donation. All names of donors and sponsors for the Divina Masses will appear in the Electronic Souvenir Program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless. Please stand. Puli po sa biyernes na po magsisimula yung ating Novena Masses. Magkita-kita po tayo dito sa Basilica at virtually. Salamat po sa inyong pakikiisa, sa inyong suporta nitong datating na kapistahan. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is ended. We go in peace. Thanks be to God. Prayer for the sick and for all your religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength to support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. And in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may all your religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.